Um, I'm just going to tell you a quick story, and it's one of my very favorite stories, and I bet a lot of the people out here have heard this story. Um, there was a man, and he, um, he was sitting inside his house, and all of a sudden, it started pouring outside. Have you ever been in, in, in your house when it starts pouring outside? Did that happen recently? <laughs> It happened to me recently in Peoria, at least. Well, let's see. What he did, because water started coming into his house, right? What he did is he climbed on top of his roof, and he believed in God. He was a Christian. He said, God, save me from this flood. God, you're going to send a miracle. I know you're going you're gonna to save me from this. And what happened, after just a little bit of time, was one of these came by. What's one of these? What is that? Miracle. Well, <laughs> amen. Yes, a miracle happened. A, a couple of men in a boat came by, and they were rowing, and they said, Sir, get in our boat. We'll save you from this flood. You'll be safe, and that would be great, right? What do you think he did? Did he get in? You know what? He didn't get in. He said, God is going to save me. God is going to make this miracle happen, and I will be saved from this flood. And they said, okay. And they rode away. After just a little bit more time, a helicopter came by. One of the pilots said, sir, get in our helicopter, and you'll be safe. And what did he do? What do you think? No? He didn't get in again. He stayed on his roof and said, no, no, God is going to send a miracle. He's going to save me. It'll be so wonderful. And, you know, the helicopter kind of said, okay, and it left. And you know what? He didn't make it out of that flood. He ended up meeting God that night. He went up to God and said, God, I was waiting for a miracle. I thought you were going to save me. You know what God said? He said, I sent the boat. I sent the helicopter. Those were from me. And what we learn from this story is that God uses us, God uses his people to help others, doesn't he? Now, you may not be able to save somebody from a flood on top of a roof, but you can help people and you, let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of us up here this morning. And if each of us decided that we would help somebody today, and if we would help somebody this week, that's eight people that are going to get help when they need it. Isn't that awesome? Right. Let's go ahead and say a quick prayer. Let's hold hands. There we go. And you're going to say it nice and loud, aren't you? Dear God. There are so many people around us each day Good. who have needs. Help us to notice who they are and to find ways to help them. With your help, we can't fail. In Jesus' loving name, we pray. Amen.